Good evening everyone, welcome back to the kitchen table. Um, tonight on the kitchen table is another one in my irregular new series um, where basically I've gone out and found some interesting gadgets, new technology, little geeky things that I think might be of interest or direct or indirect use to those of you who fly quadcopters. Um, so tonight we're going to be dealing with something that's close to my heart. One of my geeky tendencies is about the weather. But before we get to that, we better have a look at the beverage of choice this evening. It's uh, Grenache Syrah from uh, Pédoc and it's Les Espérances de nos Ancêtres. And as a French wine goes, not bad at all. Anyway, cheers. Mm, so the weather. We get a lot of weather in this country, um, and as people who fly something in the air, the weather's fairly important to us. We get to know if we're going to get rain or wind or other things that might make it a bit scary to be out in it. And the problem with forecasts is they tend to be fairly regional. I'm lucky enough to live quite close to an RAF base, so during the week um, I can get a pretty localised forecast uh, if I'm flying locally. Uh, weekends, though, they don't give anything out to the public, so... I have to rely on a, a more sort of regional forecast. And I came across a little Kickstarter project uh, the other day, which is really, well, I've backed it. So it's, it's got my vote already, and it's called Storm Tag. And it's basically, it's, it's just fantastic. It's basically a tiny, waterproof, personal weather station. It runs via Bluetooth, it talks to an app on your phone, and can track, well, if you buy the StormTag Plus, or you back the StormTag Plus at $35, which I suggest you do, it will tag, uh, it's got a pressure sensor, a temperature sensor, it will log data for as long as the battery lasts. Um, you can then sync it with uh, an app on your phone. It has a humidity sensor, it has a UV sensor as well, it's 100% waterproof. Um, fantastic. And the idea is actually, as a research project, is to crowdsource weather data. If we can get enough of people carrying these little things around, having them in their house, nailing them to their outside wall, putting them in their pocket, you can start to get some very, um, very good data on a very localised level. Um, and this is going to tie up with an app. So you have your phone, this will sync with your storm tag and it can warn you of sudden drops in pressure, for example, which might hail uh, coming rain. So if you're out flying and uh, you, know, you might get a little alert. Um, going forward though, the hope is that actually you could use this in a crowdsourced kind of way to everyone's data being shared to improve forecasts. Um, but beyond that, this is, a, this is a little weather data logger in your pocket. I mean, it's the size of, you can see here, it's probably the size of a standard SD card. A bit bigger. It's tiny. It can go on a key ring. It can go anywhere. Um, I don't know if you're interested in, in sort of, you know, some of the data it carries. You could even quite easily strap one to your quadcopter and take it up a couple of hundred feet, see what's happening to the, uh, to the temperature up there. Um, just really interesting, really interesting concept. Um, and uh, you know, just a very enthusiastic uh, pitch video as well by John Atherton, who's the um, who's the guy behind this. Um, uh, <laughs> there's there's about 28, 20, 27 days left to go on this Kickstarter. Um, they wanted to fund it to the tune of seventeen and a half thousand dollars. They've currently got sixty three thousand dollars, so it's going to happen. So basically, if you back this one, you will get it. Um, and I just think it's a, it's a great geeky little thing. Uh, there's going to be a demonstration soon uh, of how this ties in with the um, with the phone app. Um, but no, I really rate this one. And I think if you've got any kind of passing interest in whether, go and have a look at it. Um, I'll put the, uh, put the links down in the description direct or just Google Kickstarter Storm Tag and, um, and have a look. So I just thought that was a very interesting little project there to do with the weather, subject close to my heart. I live in the UK after all. We get a lot of it. Um, and I hope you found it interesting too. Uh, that's it for tonight, and we'll see you again soon back on the kitchen table. Cheers.